Okay. Good evening all. Welcome to AJ Skill International. Today we are going to discuss about the reading part A. Sample test 4 from OET official website we are using today. And thank you OET for allowing us to use this material. We can see how we can complete the re, uh, re, especially this reading part A by using Father Salim's strategies and uh, tips. Before going further, I would like to thank you Father Salim Joseph and all admin panel members for this wonderful opportunity. Especially Miss Arya and Nimi, those who helped me to prepare these PPTs and guidance. So I hope all of you have the material, right? You speak international. It's a free online OET training platform. Today we are discussing occupational English test, subtest reading part A and our uh, sample test for from OET official website. So our intention is to fall in love with OET. And all of you know reading part A, there are four texts, A to D and one team, 20 questions and only 15 minutes we have to get it to complete that questions uh, and find out the answers. Then greatest challenge or enemy is in this subtest is in uh, time. So we required expeditious or faster reading. Our expectation is to go, you know, father always will tell how to aim for 50 to 500 or A score, uh, not B. I mean, which comes in between 350 to 440. So we can hope for that. So in this reading part A, if we get 18 out of 20, there are more chances to get the A scores. So the greatest mistake, what we are doing while studying or while preparing for our exam, targeting B grade. So uh, psychologically uh, impact on mind and brain, if you get to 28 or 30, okay, that's enough, um, confident enough to get a B score. So finally, the result, what will come, it comes around 330 or 320 or 340. So if we aim A score, definitely we can get at least B in the exam. So we are going for reading part A, managing diabetic answers. So how can we find out the answers with the strategies and tips which we, which is taught by our, our beloved father, Salim Joseph. Reading part A, in 10 minutes, tip 1, begin with a scheme, general ideas for questions 1 to 7. Normally we have to start from the beginning or first question to 20. Tip 2, focus on each text. Then tip Three, skim and search for clues. So, so what are the clues we have to search while skimming the text? First one is title. Second one, session, section headings. Third one, subheadings. Then fourth is names. Fifth one is any numbers or percentage which is there in the text. Sixth is sequential expressions. Seventh is time expression. Eighth, scale. Ninth, adjectives. And tenth one is negative ex expression. If anything is there in the text, we can highlight or underline it. Okay. And he taught us 12 steps to crack reading part A in 10 minutes. So the first step is identify four text headings and write down on a piece of paper. Second one is understand the relationship as well as the sequence among the four text headings. And the third step, skim the four text and then highlight the Clues. So what is there? The main clues. Fourth and the fifth steps are very, very important. The fourth one is read the question statement and uh, highlight the hedging words. The fifth one is read the question statement and match the texture. So when you are reading the question, you you ha you will get an idea which text we have to go and find out the answer. Sixth step is write down the hedging words. Identify in the questions. Then uh, seventh one is arrange the hedging words into four columns. We are having four textures. So according to that, we can arrange four columns and write out the hedging words, which we can get it from the questions. questions. Eighth one is confirm one to seven answers. Then ninth one is locate the answer. Tenth st step is write the answers in the answer booklet. Eleventh one is proofreading. And the twelfth, fill the self-assessment form. Okay. Now you are having a uh, doubt. How it's possible within 10 minutes all these things uh, can complete it. So these 12 steps are applicable when you are 
practicing at home or when you are preparing your oet exam okay and this one to five steps means identify four text headings and write down in a paper so paper is not av uh, available when you are appearing an exam so in the text which they given no in that you can write the uh, heading uh, which you you want to give okay you can give according to your understanding a heading okay the second one uh, second one understand the relationship and sequence about this four text headings then skim the four to te four text and highlight the clues read the question statement highlight the hedging words and the fifth one read the question statement and match the text these five steps are very very important while you are writing the exam i hope you can understand right yes 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 we can yes, yes ma'am Uh, those who have this hard copies you can just go through it so in yeah, the text yeah. they given text a assessing a diabetic foot ulcers so by yeah. skimming uh, diabetic foot ulcers some abbreviations they given but you no know, we are uh, uh, reading down no it's mentioned neuropathic ischemic and neuroischemic and all so i felt not only assessing the diabetic foot ulcers it would be better to give a heading what are the types of diabetic foot ulcers so here i am i given types of diabetic foot ulcers my heading okay so according to your understanding you can change the heading which is easy to and guide you to find out the answer or which text you have to go to find out the answer is it clear yes yes, yes. okay in text b applying the dressing to dfu is which is given in the sample and while skimming uh, we can go through for inspect or highly excluding dfus so not only for the application some inspection we have to do in the wound so i am um, i given no the application as well as the inspection of dressing as the heading of text b in the text c so while uh, the reading we can find out not much everything is mentioned in the uh, removal of tissues and and all and how to manage the ulcer foot ulceration and all so debridements of dfus the heading which i given in that and the for, uh, text d here the heading which they given is dressings of the accused advantages and disadvantages while reading no low adherence uh, hydrochloroalkaloids uh, hydrogels uh, no different types of dressings they given so i given the heading of types of dressings for the accused these four text first step is to identify four text headings and write down on a piece of paper so here the four headings which i given text a is type of dfus but in the material they given assessing of dfus okay so as i told you in the beginning according to your uh, understanding you can change the headings okay then second one application as well and inspection of dressing c is debridement of dfus and d is type of dressings for dfus So understand the relationship and the sequence of among the four text headings. So, so here, no, in the uh, first text A, different types of DFUs. Second text, so, so we have to understand how sequence, what is the sequence which they given in that text. So first they given in the types. Second application and inspections of dressing, then wound debridement, then the type of dressings what they are using or they are suggesting to use. Uh, for diabetic foot ulcers again here the third step it's way, which is very important and which will guide you to um, reach the answers or skim the text and highlight the clues as all of you knows we have to highlight or uh, underline the titles section headings sub headings names numbers or percentage sequential ex expressions frequency expressions scale adjectives negative expressions and abbreviations so in the text can you tell me what are the things we can identify first one is title managing diabetic foot ulcers which is there in the text not which one i give which which is the one i given no the heading that is different for my understanding i given that heading but the yeah. title which is given by the text is managing diabetic foot ulcers we can underline that then assessing diabetic foot ulcers that is the section heading uh, section headings 
then neuropathic ischemic neuro ischemic and all the subheadings which is given in this text okay <laughs> then some scale of which is given in that uh, that no that is the scale can understand and uh, we can underline it then the percentage which is given 35% 15% and 50% that also you can mark it so how can we mark all those things here the first one when you are skimming assessing diabetic foot ulcers diabetic foot ulcers or dfu some abbreviations as well as the name of a disease condition they given must is a modal verb which is given then the subheadings or name neuropathic ischemic and neuro ischemic often is a scale then coming back to some name of the body parts and percentage we can underline all these words which is important and which help to um find out the answers easily in the second uh, or b text b so uh, section heading c is given applying dressing for dfus then while reading may is there it's a modal verb then coming back to the second line metatarsal heads and food it's the name of a body parts then coming avoid strong adhesive so the skim is there and uh, uh, the fifth toe and the fifth metatarsal head these are the name of body parts then coming down some modal verb is there can so uh, when you are practicing if it is underlined and write down that will definitely help to improve initially you may get some difficult but continuously if you are practicing that will definitely help to find out in easily okay so again abbreviations then coming to the second paragraph two or three days so which is the time expressions again may is there it's highlighted it's a model verb first few days again time of the expressions then some it's a scale and in the last cellulitis it's a name of of disease etc so these are the things we have to underline or highlight while reading or while skimming the text so in uh, text to see again what are the uh, words or points we have to highlight is again section headings abbreviations the first priority so that is time expression again we can come to uh, down some vascular surgeon it's a name then it can can be there in the last uh, line so it's a modal verb again specialist podiatrist or a nurse again the name of a professional uh, then come back to down must must is there it's a modal verb so we can go to the next text b so here the subjects they given dressings for dfu then what are the advantages and disadvantages okay in the low in the first line low adherence and the minimal absorbency minimal means a scale okay again we can come uh, skim the uh, text so can is there it's a modal verb the several days it's a time expression again the next one disadvantages may may that and all modal verbs dermatitis is a name of the disease and uh, thyroiditis or pregnancy is a name of the disease or condition so all these things we can highlight or underline it again now you know the sequence type of dfus application and inspection of dressings for dfus debridement of dfus and uh, type of dressings for dfus so we can go for the questions okay yeah. i hope all of you are having the hard copy so find out from which text we can from the uh, key words or key phrase the question no 1 to 6 for each question 1 to 6 decide which text a b c or d the information comes from write a letter a b c or d in the phrase in the space provided you may use any letter more than once in which text you can find out the information about so what are the heading which i given to that particular text i mentioned in the corner so you can find out from where you can um, where from where this question okay the first question is how often to change a dressing so here the key words are key phrase is often to change a dressing so can you find out from where b mm. That's from the uh, second paragraph. B, B, B okay. second paragraph. So you need to write down in your uh, booklet, and finally we can go go through the answers. And the second question, 
ensuring patients understand and consequences of tissue removal so here the key phrase which is given is tissue removal mm -hmm. so tissue removal is nothing but debridement debridement ma'am debridement so no need to go back to see the text or in the you know text and find out the answers with the support of this keywords okay. or key phrase we can find out where, from where you know, which text this or not okay. am i clear yes so the third question is the reason for not choosing certain products where it is mentioned different types of products in the text d c d and we can go for the next question the need to monitor a wound so monitor a wound is the key phrase if you know how to identify the key word or key phrase that will help to identify which text you have to go and find out the answers so here is the key phrase is monitor a wound where is it in the text which text so where yes, we have yes, to no, do the inspection sorry, and monitor please. and all it's there in the text b inspection okay. application yes. and in okay uh, okay no problem um, b so ma'am the fifth question how common each kind of diaphilis so find this and but what types types no, types what is the answer of uh, d d so d. if you know how to you uh, know how they paraphrase the sentences and uh, and if you know the uh, words which they which is uh, you know easy to understand it will help you to find out the answers and the sixth one is how good a dressing is at the soaking of fluid so different type of dressings or dressing is at soaking fluid so where it is uh, clearly mentioned in which text uh -huh. d d no you have to tell in d d, d. d. okay d, d. so again dressing. again we can find out what kind if it is is it if a patient has lost all sensation where we can find out the lost all sensation that key phrase where we can see is it extra yeah ma'am lost sense sensory yeah. in the neuropathic lost Low all sensation, sensation. right mm -hmm. neuropathy neuropathic neuropathic i'm not sensory. asking i'm not asking the answer a, a, where a. we have to yeah ma'am a text a, a. text a. 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 a text a which is paraphrased in the Uh, text text as well as the questions. Okay, so if you know uh, how to identify the key phrase, it is easy to go to text A and find out the answer. Otherwise, you have to read all four text and for that answer. Is that clear? Yes, yes. Okay. So yes, eighth question: If the patient's DFU is beneath the nail, where we can see DFU is beneath the nail, and what kind is it likely to be? Again, kind is there and beneath the nail. The feet is beneath the nail. This text A, ma'am. Paragraph A. Yes, yes. yes Again, we have to go to <laughs> text A. Ninth question is: What type of dressing would you avoid if a patient's wound is infected? And the text D. Wound is text D. Text D. Text D. Text D, ma'am. D. Okay. So if you know how to identify a key word or key phrase. that will definitely help to find out the answer in a easy way tenth question if you need to fill a cavity which dressing is best again which dressing d. and the key phrase and is also. need to fill a cavity dressing. so where you have to search the answer d d d, d. so again eleventh question which type of dressing may cause an inflammation of the skin so and also d cause an inflammation d, d. That and also the, D. Yes. D, ma'am. The type of dressing is also there. D. So from yeah. the question itself, we can identify which texture we have to search and find out the answer. <laughs> so that answer key phrase, you know, the key phrase which is helping is cause of cause an in inflammation. Then twelve. If cost is an issue, which dressing again? Yeah. So yeah, where we have D. the pain is so D. The key. key phrase which is help, helping to find out the answer is the cost is an issue but the key phrase which is helping to understand which text we have to go and find out the answer yeah. is which it is it right? d can you follow is, me yes yes, yes ma'am okay 13th question which two types of dfu often show signs of necrosis again two types of dfu d. types of dfu dear yeah. yeah. 
okay oh, sorry yeah, yeah. i'm sure science of necrosis so <laughs> sorry, we have to find if something they may yeah, say yeah. where the necrosis so okay or the the yeah, parapet yeah. is some uh, yes yeah. so here types of dfu which heading that's why when you are reading a reading uh, part, part a try to give your own words as a heading and <laughs> which you know he, will help you to easily understand where you have to go and uh, search the answers and this is the typical example from uh, no oit sample test how they are paraphrasing the words both in the text as well as uh, and the and, and the questions is okay. that okay okay i hope you can understand yeah yeah okay 14th question which type of dressing provide moisture to the to a wound so again it's coming type d, of dressing so where d d, d. So, the key phrase is helping us to find out the answer is provide moisture to a wound clear yes okay. yes ma'am so we can go for the next 15 to 20 questions complete yes. each of the sentences 15 to 20 with a word or short phrase from one or two words each answers may include words numbers or both okay so 15 the question check that dash will go on after the dressing has been applied right so mm -hmm. here check that again check check uh, can you tell me the other word of check which word is mentioned in the headings instead of check b ma'am so we have to check the answer in b b b b, b ma'am next but b the uh, key phrase which is given is after the dressing right so yes. in the b where the word which is after the dressing or the same word either synonyms or paraphrasing words there in the text to be you have to check it is that clear yes, yes ma'am 10 16th question the dressing should follow the space the shape of the wound so that there is no dash again dressing b b ma'am yes, also b b b okay Draw a line around any dash and ask the patient to get in touch if it is worsen. So draw <laughs> a line and touch if it is if it is worsen. So where where we can see all these things, inspections or a draw a line, any problem is there and all in which text we can find out the answer? In the B. Yes, B. Okay. Hello. It is in B, no? Yes, yes. B. So we can see how they know how um, we can find out in B or which text is it. Okay, I mentioned. 18th one, you might need to involve a dash in the patient's care, care if you cannot detect a pulse in the, in the foot. So the key phrase which is given, you cannot detect a pulse in the foot. Okay. So where we have to go and involve it. So that might be a person. Right. So where we seen some name of person or some professional? C, ma'am. C, 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 C. So this is the way we have to Text C. C, good at rest. Good at rest. So 19, to maintain good blood flow, leave a dash free of tight bandages. So uh, somewhere we mentioned uh, uh, a different type of uh, no, application or something, no? Where, uh, in which text it was? That is in B. 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 Okay. So maintain good blood flow is the hedging word. And the uh, next key phrase is tight bandage. Okay. Bandages. And the 20th question, make sure the wound is level. Otherwise, the dash won't be able to grow across. So where we can see that, where we have to go and search, won't be able to grow across. The wound is break. level. Yes. Break. Okay. So we can go through it. The answers from the key with the help of a keyword or key phrase. The first answer is what? What answer you got while uh, reading that part A diabetic foot ulcers? D. Okay. How you got that answer? Okay. Just check the dressing, right? How often the change the change the dressing daily change the dressing application text B last paragraph or infected or highly exuded exuded infect the wound and change the dressing daily 
daily how often to change a dressing for three days yeah so application and inspection of dressing right so it's there in text b b yes right yes yes ma'am okay so tissue removal is that uh, that key phrase will help guide you where in which text so c is correct right second answer is c text c that is correct yes right? yes c c yes, yes ma'am ma c is correct any doubt in that yes no ma'am okay and third one choosing certain product so where it mentioned different type of product is in d, d. right d ma'am yes. d yes yes ma'am so choosing certain product product where in text d monitor a wound where we have to find means uh, find out the words or uh, related b. things in b okay then each kind of types of dfu right that will be there in text a dressing is that soaking up fluid where again it's a dressing is there and different <laughs> types which is soaking fluid and all where we can, we can find out in text b so i got all of you got six marks yes, or yes. six correct answers right yes yes wow. yes again, correct okay the loss of sensation as i said you know a and uh, dfu is beneath the nail where we have to search in text a then type of dressings and a need to patients wound is infected right where we have to see that d d then need to fill a cavity where we have to search the answer is in d d, d. then cause an inflammation that also will be there in d, d. right then cost is an issue again we have to search the answer in text d. d two types of dfu so different types of dfu where we have to go and search the answer in text a provide yeah. moisture to the to a wound where we have to search a different type of dressing so in text d. d right yes 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 ma'am so after a dressing so that, uh, you have to check so after a dressing what you have to do so that answer we have to go and search in text b okay so the dressings should follow the follow the shape so where so I draw a line around any dash so where we have to search that if it is person it's in b okay <clears throat> involve a particular person or you know where we have to see that we have to search the answer in 18th question it's in c, c. okay you cannot detect a pulse in the in the food so c and uh, 19th question we have to search a tight bandage just the key phrase which they given in that question so it's there in b and make if the wound is level won't be able to grow across so that we have to see in the text c or debridement shall we go for the answer option what kind uh, is it uh, if the patient has loss of sensation where it is mentioned what is the answer neuropathy so here clearly mentioned neuropathic sensory loss but in the question what they given loss or sensation right yes yes then the eighth question dfu is beneath the nail so what is the answer neuro ischemic neuro ischemic of the foot and under the under the yes, nail under toenail so a, again they paraphrase the sentence right yes, yes ma'am yeah okay type of dressings the patient wound is infected so where we have to do where we have to go in texture d ma'am in texture d. d okay we can check it in texture d where it is can uh, can be left or several drays or aid auto uh, lysis concern may use for infection uh, here it's mentioned right so the answer is yes, hydrocolloids hydrocolloids colloids need to fill a cavity again we have to go to text d right 
the yes, know ma'am. how they paraphrase with that useful for packing useful for packing so what is the packing, answer packing they poor alginate they are highly absorbent bacteria yes. chemostatic so and how useful they paraphrase in the question as well as the uh, text in the text they mention useful for packing but in the question yes. what they they used the uh, no. filling the, fill, the fill fill uh, fill fill the need to fill a so cavity need to fill the cavity right hmm. yeah again cause an inflammation so again we can we can go to text d d in where yeah. it is mentioned disadvantage occasional hmm. dermatitis with adhesives hmm. So which dressing is that? Alginates. Alginates. Foam. Foam. Huh? Foam. Alginates. Okay. We just see. Which one? Dermatitis is the disadvantages of which dressing? Foams. Right. Foam. Yeah. Oh, eleventh question. You are sorry. Eleventh question only, no? Yes. Tenth yeah. one. Tenth one is alginates, no? Yes. Yes. Tenth one yeah. is alginates. <laughs> okay. If cost huh. is an issue, again. It's a it's in text D. So what D. is the key phrase D. here? They Low given adherence. first is Low that issue. Silver silver oh. impregnated. The last point in disadvantage. Low adherence. Inexpensive. 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 Okay. If cost is an issue in the question, but in the text, how they paraphrase the inexpensive. Inexpensive. Okay. Yes, so what is the answer? Low adherence. Low adherence. Right. To the show signs of necrosis. Where we can see that in no, texture. B, B, B. Text B. 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 Types of B. Oh, sorry. Of A. 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 Ischemic A. and neuroischemic. Neuro ischemic. Neuro Neuro ischemic. Neuro that is the necrosis. Answer. Both in mentioned necrosis. Okay. Hmm. Then 14 to question. Type of dressings. Provide moisture to a wound. So we, again, we have to go to I text D, ma'am. Text D. Okay. So where it is mentioned? Hydrogel. See, hydrogel. How they paraphrase no, that word? Hydrogel. Donate liquid. Donate liquid. So if you can identify this paraphrasing, it's easy to understand. Otherwise, we have to search all the text to find out the answer. Yes, Clear. Yes. Okay. Yes, then sixteenth. 15th question, check that that will go on after the dressing. So, where we have to go in text B, B. right? Yeah. Sixth, sixth bulletin, remember that food where needs to accommodate. To accommodate. Right. So, in the question what they mentioned, still go on, but in the text, they, they paraphrase it that accommodate. If you can identify this uh, paraphrasing, it is easy to understand. Uh, get the answer. So, what is the answer? Footwear. 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 Okay. The dressing should follow the space, follow the shape. So, where we have to go for the sixteenth answer? Fifth bulletin paper. That is in B. 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 Right. So Ensure wound dead space. Ensure wound dead space is eliminated. 17th question, draw a line. Where we have to go? Again in B. Text B. B. So yeah. some disease conditions or name of the disease, where it is mentioned. It is in the so while last Kimi para. highlighted that, right? So what is the answer? La cellulitis. Cellulitis. That is given in last para. Extent yeah. of any cellulitis. Mm -hmm. Yes. Because Idea to mark the extent of any Yeah. So 18th question, you might need to involve a dash, dash. So one some particular person. So where we have to go for this answer? The each text we have C. to search. C. Yes. C. C. Refer so to here. as muscular surgeon. First paragraph, last. Yes. 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 Okay. Yes. <laughs> then to maintain a good to maintain good blood flow 
leave dash free of tight bandage so where we have to go for that which text avoid uh, in b ma'am b ma'am ma yes in b b avoid so tight bandaging one, and the fifth toe so avoid tight bandaging and the fifth so where is that toe. word you no know, tourniquet uh, effect right in the text it is mentioned the tourniquet effect but in the questions what they mention or tight, how they paraphrase it uh, tight bandage tight bandage so what is the answer to so, over toes over toes okay and the last question make sure the wound is level otherwise the gash won't be able to grow across again where we have to go and find out the answer that is in c c c the edge of the effect whereby epithelial epithelium falls to migrate across the across a form and level granulation and in the question what they mentioned the level granulation they uh, no, sorry in the text they what they mentioned level granulation base okay but it is paraphrased in the questions is what level wound is level Otherwise, wound is level. level so what is the Ep answer epithelium the epithelium epithelium so so we can see So what are the questions from text one? Sorry, text A. Each kind of DFUs in A. See how they paraphrased the loss of sen sensation, but in the text the sensory loss. Is that clear? Yes, yes. Is beneath the nail in eighth question, but in the text what they mentioned under toenail. Okay. Hmm. Then we can go to the Next one, text B. So what are the questions? One, four, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, and nineteen questions from text B. In the sorry, still go on in the question they mentioned, but in the text they mention uh, paraphrase to accommodate. And there is no in which one? There is no. See the dressing should follow the shape of the wound so that there is no. So here instead of there is no in the text one. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Then what is the next question? In draw a line. Yeah, draw a line. Line. But in uh, in the text, what they mention? Mark the extent. Mark the extent of any cell. Yeah. Okay. And uh, the which we discussed the tight bandage in the question, but uh, in the text, effect. Paraphrase to tourniquet effect. Both are same, right? Same meaning. Yes. Mm. Any doubt in that? No, no, no. So, what are the questions from text to C, two eighteen and twenty? Here, tissue removal. So we know that is debridement. Then the person is vascular surgeon. But the other word which is paraphrased is the wound is level. But in the text, what they mention level granula granulation base. Okay. Hmm. So soaking up fluid in text, sorry, in the question, but the in the text they mention absorbent. Absorbent. In the question they mention avoid, but in the text they paraphrased to concern. The same thing. The question need to fill, need to fill the cavity, but in the text what they mention useful for packing. Packing. But, no. Okay. It's mm. paraphrased. Then again, cause an inflammation. Mm. Here, dermatitis. Occasional dermatitis. Okay. Cost is an issue. Right. Inexpensive. How they paraphrased? Inexpensive. Is that clear? Moisture to a wound. <laughs> So what they mentioned in the text, how they paraphrased that? Donate liquid. Actually, ma'am, uh, how do I learn the and how to show like that in reading part? A most probably I go out of twenty nineteen eighteen like that. But every day I will see the videos, others video, either any member update new video. First particulars when I go to show the paper. Paper before that I will see at least thirty minute, forty minute. The video after that, I will do the exercise one or two exercises. 
so outcome is uh, like that each and everything in your mind how to what what things so like that one to seven days eight days course, ten days same, uh, same things where i see and apply then definitely each and everything automatically come this is my experience how do i, I learn the things like that i go yes. in the part b uh, when i go part b every day i see the video before the part b the lot of videos like that granular where many of videos father already kept in the platform so first i will see the old videos and after that uh, i will go to solve the paper that, at times i will see out of six five question many times six, six question also right so this is this see is the, my uh, technique the how method to yeah the method you have to follow is you have to watch the video you have to write the notes that is very important so uh, yeah, you just write uh, the notes the note. yeah yes, yes. Can, yeah the I same thing so you note. can write the notes and then you will get an idea oh what I have to do if we are watching me and then we'll focus many of the strategies. So if you're writing in, uh, if you're writing the note, then it will be uh, beneficial um, to you. Okay. So afterwards also, also you can just read that and you can practice according to that. And one very great thing, ma'am, every day like that, someone is take, uh, all, all members are in active in this group. So take sure. another topic. If everyone is like that, they are continually follow the videos and definitely put a lot of knowledge automatically. Yes, yes. Father has explained in each each module, there is a video. Each thing yes, one, everyone, in the, in the every when I see, no, I note like that father's video, I see each and every video most probably. So everyone try to do the best like that student get much more knowledge through the videos. Ma'am, uh, my name is Rajendra Kumar and uh, Actually, सबसे पहले तो मैं सर को धन्यवाद दूंगा कि उन्होंने इतने अच्छे वीडियोस बनाए हैं कि कहीं पे भी मुझे नहीं लगता कि किसी प्लेटफॉर्म में इतना सपोर्ट कहीं मिला होगा और मैं पिछले एक महीने से सर के सारे वीडियोस देखता हूं हर दिन देखता हूं मैं और ओईटी पिछले एक महीने से मैं तैयारी कर रहा हूं मैं अभी मेरा लिसनिंग है वो ट्वेंटी एट के आसपास है मेरा और रीडिंग है वो भी मेरा ट्वेंटी और थर्टी के बीच में चल रहा है मोस्ट मोस्ट ऑफ लिसनिंग पार्ट ए और रीडिंग पार्ट ए है वो बहुत अच्छा हो गया है और इस सब वीडियोस में देख देख के ही रोज मैं हर दिन लर्न करता हूँ अपना मैक्सिमम टाइम इसी में स्पेंड करता हूँ मैं अभी गवर्नमेंट जॉब कर रहा हूँ लेकिन लीव uh, लेकर के मैं अपनी प्रिपरेशन कर रहा हूँ ओई के लिए मैं और आप सब लोग इतना अच्छे से एक्सप्लेन करते हैं कि कहीं से भी ढूंढने से ऐसा मेटेरियल नहीं मिलेगा मैं बहुत समय तक यूट्यूब पे सर्च करता रहा काफी समय तक मैं परेशान होता रहा गलती से एक दिन मैंने ये वीडियो देख लिया उसके बाद में सारे वीडियोस में टोटल 200 के समथिंग 200 ढाई सौ वीडियो प्लेटफॉर्म में तो मैक्सिमम वीडियोस मैंने देखे हैं और हर दिन मैं रिपीट कर करके देखता रहता हूं तो बहुत चीज लर्न करता हूं आज मुझे ये ये पता चला कि ऑनलाइन क्लास होती है ऐसे भी ज्वाइन करनी होती है अब मुझे मैम एक चीज का अभी भी स्टिल मतलब डाउट है कि जो जैसे कि ग्रुप डिस्कशन वाला वो कैसे करते हैं और रोल प्ले में मुझे जैसे कि मैंने रोल प्ले भी स्टार्ट कर दिया राइटिंग मेरा काफी हद तक ठीक है और वो जो ग्रुप डिस्कशन में अगर ऐड होना हो तो उसके लिए क्या करना पड़ेगा मैम तो आपको ग्रुप डिस्कशन में पार्टिसिपेट करना चाहिए क्या हाँ यस मैम वो थोड़ा हेल्प होगा और अगर कोई भी मुझे मेल या फीमेल कोई भी इंटरेस्टेड हो जो कि रोल प्ले के लिए अगर कोई पांच मिनट अगर डे टाइम में एक या दो टाइम में तो वो उसके लिए भी हेल्पफुल हो मेरे लिए भी हेल्पफुल हो तो अगर ऐसा कोई भी कैंडिडेट अगर इंटरेस्टेड हो तो प्लीज मैम थोड़ी सी मेरी हेल्प हो जाएगी उससे और हाँ बाकी ठीक है आपको आप मैसेज कर दो किसी एडमिन की एडमिन को ओके टेलीग्राम में ठीक है मैम गेट करूंगी आपको ओके ओके मैम ग्रुप में मैसेज कर दो ना उसमें टेलीग्राम पर टेलीग्राम में टेलीग्राम में मेन प्लेटफॉर्म में और एडमिन सुनिधा डी और मुझे आर्या आनंद और निमी जॉन किसी को ठीक है ओके मैम और मैम रियली में पूरे पूरे कहीं यू कहीं पे भी ऐसा प्लेटफॉर्म नहीं है वाकई जिसको मतलब अप्रिशिएट किया जाए जो कंटेंट ना इतना यूनिक है हम लोग भी खुशी है <laughs> नहीं रियली जो एफर्ट्स है मैं तो मैं कभी सुनता था एक्चुअली मैं कभी YouTube पे तो बिलीव ही नहीं करता था कि ऐसी चीजें भी YouTube क्योंकि YouTube में हर कोई ऐसे ही डाल देता है मैं यहाँ से पी कर रहा हूँ मैम और बी एच से तो नर्सिंग में मेरा मोर देन थर्टी ईयर का गवर्नमेंट जॉब हो गया है और अब मैं सोच रहा हूँ कि इंडिया में स्कोप ही नहीं लग रहा बहुत ज्यादा ठीक है और नॉलेज की भी बेसिकली मैं मैंने जो हम लोग प्रैक्टिस कर रहे हैं ना हाँ हाँ तो ये जो प्लेटफॉर्म है इसमें 
कोई भी अगर कंटिन्यूस मेहनत करता है तो अपने आप मैं स्टार्टिंग में आकर के परेशान हो गया था लेकिन धीरे धीरे मैंने सब वीडियोस देखे तो धीरे धीरे सारे मेरे मॉड्यूल्स क्लियर हो गए अब टैक्टिक्स हैं जो मॉडल वर्ब है हैजिंग वर्ड्स है कॉन्ट्रास्ट वर्ड्स है वो देख करके आंसर आइडेंटिफाई करना बहुत ईजी हो गया नहीं तो ऐसा लगता था कि सब ब्लाइंड है और मैं ये सोचता था कि नर्सिंग की कोई चीजों के लिए कि नर्सिंग का नॉलेज यहाँ यूटिलाईज नहीं हो पा रहा था <laughs> तो प्रैक्टिस करना है एक बार मैं खुद ही दूसरा रोल प्ले बोलता हूँ फिर दूसरा करता हूँ <laughs> तो बेसिकली तो मैं सोच रहा था कोई ऐसा कोई पार्टनर वाकई में इंटरेस्टेड हो तो मेरे लिए भी हेल्प हो जाएगी और बाकी वो स्पीकिंग पार्टनर के लिए आपको अनिता लोगों को मैसेज करना पड़ेगा कि क्योंकि शी इज प्रोवाइडिंग स्पीकिंग पार्टनर ओके मैम ओके थैंक यू मैम यस वो डिस्कशन के लिए किसी एडमिन को आप मैसेज कर दो मुझे और सुनिधा डी ओके और सुमी प्रताप है इधर किसी को मैसेज कर दो वो गेट करूंगी आपको ठीक है। वेल एक्सप्लेन एंड गिवन गुड इंफॉर्मेशन एंड वी आर ऑल आई थिंक ऑल आर इंटरेस्टेड इन लर्निंग नाउ ऑल्सो है yeah it is actually i have i have uh, tried another also another uh, group also but in that uh, they don't uh, explain like in uh, detail you know, but we have to get they don't explain in more detail like father explain each and everything father explain so i also um, uh, what is it inspired to go through all this so i am happy I feel so happy thank and you. enriched, enriched with the knowledge. Thank you, thank you, because thank you. um, yeah, we are very happy to hear all these comments. Okay, as Jinta said and Presia, everybody, because as this is a free platform, if we can provide like this a service, we are really proud yes. Yes. of that. Because uh, this all uh from Father Selin Joseph. Yes, I don't know if it's not there. Then definitely will not uh, get all these strategies and tips. Yeah. So father, yeah, father is always happy to and definitely is always things. happy to share. No, he, he with a smiling face, he is very happy yes. and he is encouraging like uh, to learn. So that is also another uh, good thing for us to come out like. with fear and yes like that we have to share whatever knowledge we have definitely we have to share our knowledge to others if we can help at least yes. one person then uh, yes, it's yes. like we are helping their generation right as father yes. always says so yes we can share this uh, platform to your friends your family members whom or you know yes so that they will join they'll get free training and mm. that is our highlight we are not charging even single rupee for any of our service even material sessions for those and if if you have yes. any doubt you can always discuss in the main platform you can share your doubts the thing is when you are sharing the questions you have to put the answer option also without answer key we will not accept because sometimes some yeah. spammers will uh, send some uh, like uh, they'll say uh, this is our doubt all those thing and our aspirants they will be back of that and simply oh, okay. waste their time Mm-hmm. okay so the thing is you have to you can ask your doubts along with the answer key that they will definitely help you you can discuss in the main platform like your doubts your concerns everything and uh, if you want to um, share your learning experience you can share your learning experience even after this session you can share your learning experience what you have learned in this session so okay. that will be also helpful to others that is also an empowering Yes. Because those who have not attended the session, they will get an idea mm. Mm, what okay. we have discussed in this session. So whatever, mm. whatever, um, like you are learning, 
you can share as a learning experience even we will definitely post this in the youtube um, maybe within two to three days so the same thing you can post in the youtube comment space okay whatever learning experience you have okay same thing you can just post in the youtube comment space as well as in our main plat main telegram platform so that is also an empowering let's empower mm -hmm. others and grow together thank you so much ma'am and ma'am uh, for reading part a how many uh, reading part a should i have to done in a day it's not the quantity Quality. It's the quality of practice. Yes, the quality. We don't the recommend quality. to practice more than one material in a day. We don't recommend. We will yeah. never recommend. I don't we'll say you can it. practice one oh. material for one week. Yes, ma'am. But I am able to manage my time to stay in and uh, I, usually I get marks around 18, 19. I'm struggling just with skimming. Nothing else. See, if you are taking three minutes in your skimming and if you are able to complete within 15 minutes all the questions, then it's fine. You can take three minutes time. It's up to you. In OET, we can say it's called flexibility. So if you're taking three minutes for a skimming and if you can complete all your questions within 15 minutes, then it's fine. It's up okay. to you. We are, not, we are not telling like you have to follow everything whatever we are saying. It's up to you. Yes, I take Thank per you, day only one. I take, I'm Tracia, I take only one per day. One reading part, one per day. Otherwise, I will not be able to do it. According to that, I am managing. Actually, ma'am, uh, how do I learn the and how to solve? Like that in reading part, uh, most probably I go out of 20, 19, 18, like that. But every day I will see the videos, others video, either any member update new video. First particular when I go to solve the paper, before that I will see at least 30 minutes, 40 minutes the video. After that I will do the exercise, one or two exercises. Mm -hmm. So outcome is like that each and everything in your mind, how to what, what things. So like that one to seven days, eight days, ten days, same, uh, same things when I see and apply, then definitely each and everything automatically comes. This is my experience. How do I, I learn the things? Like that, I go yes. in part B. Uh, when I go part B, every day I see the video before the part B, the lot of videos, like the granular fever, many of videos father already kept in the platform. So first I will see the old videos. And after that, uh, I will go to solve the paper. That at times, I will see out of six, five questions, many times six questions also write. So this is, this is the, my technique. Yeah, the method you have to follow is you have to watch the video, you have to write the notes. That is very important. So uh, yeah, you can I just write uh, the notes. Note. Yeah, yes, yes. Can, yeah the same thing. So you note. can write the notes and then you will get an idea of oh, what I have to do. If we are watching me and then we'll forget many of the strategies. So if you're writing in, uh, if you're writing the note, then it will be uh, beneficial um, to you. Okay. Mm -hmm. So afterwards also, uh, afterwards also you can just, uh, just read that and you can practice according to that. And one very great thing, ma'am, every day like that, someone is take, uh, all, all members are in active in this group. So take sure. another topic. If uh, everyone is like that, they are continually, continually, they uh, follow the videos and definitely put a lot of knowledge automatically. Yes, yes. Father has explained in each, each module, there is a video. Each thing. Yes, ma'am, everyone, explained. in the, in the, everyone I see, no, I noted like that father's video, I see each and every video most probably. So everyone try to do the best like that. A student get much more knowledge through the videos. Okay, so we are happy and proud of your words. Thank you. Okay, thank you, ma'am. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you so much, ma'am. Thank you. We, need, we I request you to give more and more live sessions like we can express ourselves. Uh, so this is, I think you are on mute. I uh, know I, I suggest that if, if you can give more more and more videos like this, you no, know, we can share our uh, insights like you know freely. So in from that we can also come out of the fear and uh, 
tension exactly now it yeah. communicate See, we are planning to give at least one uh, one one reading party a for this war yeah. we are other admin members are preparing for that so mm -hmm. nothing to worry See, our side it's a student perception okay how we find out the answer if i am explaining or the person uh, as a student no uh, that may be yes. helped to understand in a better way mm -hmm. uh, so we are planning to do each and every modules and every day one one uh, sessions mm -hmm. so we are preparing and work out for that as you we are also working and we are also having family members in between we are finding out the yes, time yes. to do all these yeah. works and if you are also really interested those who are you know can join mm -hmm. along with us as a part okay. a family member mm -hmm. we are in a family right i agree but you know yeah a little more freely to we can explain exactly. to you. Yeah, that is correct. But uh, one thing is that now this A part is very nicely explained and we can score more. Very, yeah. very nicely explained and we are free that we know what to do like now. No, exactly. like that. So according to each part, if we, that's what I, I also... Yes, of have... course, we are planning to see the this entire week we are planning to conduct a reading part A that is our um, benchmark study plan. According to that, we are going on okay. so this week this entire week is reading part a and we are trying to cover all days at least one one sessions like which i conducted today no same like okay. sessions will be there we are trying to do it tomorrow is onam and most of the aspirants from kerala they may are busy yeah, with the onam celebration so after that so, definitely will be there uh, some sessions so you can also join and so tomorrow is holiday Sorry. Yes, we are planning Sorry. to declare as a, as a holiday. Okay. Mm -hmm. And uh, next week is reading part C. Definitely we will come with one, uh, not only one, uh, try to cover the entire week if possible. If all are busy, um, means free, they will means we need, require time to uh, prepare the PPTs and materials. Mm -hmm. and, you know, it yes, may take yes. some time. Even though we will try to cover it. Then. Weekly once also is okay. Like, you know, we are doing daily, no. We are doing daily the, this one, what is it, the Discussion. work we are doing daily. Then if you give us weekly once, at least one top, one module, that will be nice, no? So we are trying to do more than that. More than that, so okay. Try to cover, if possible, those who are willing to do the session. So we want to do it every yeah. day. In six yeah, okay. days in a week and Sundays, mm -hmm. as you know, it's a whole day. Mm -hmm. So uh, we are trying to do it. But how much is uh, possible, we don't know. But we will try our level best to do cover it. Okay, thank you. Thank you for your concerns. Thank you so much. Anything else you. you want to? Or anyone? This is clear. Thank you. Yeah. Good. The last session of Madam Arya Anand. Uh, she yeah. done a live session of uh, reading part A. Actually, it helped me a lot. I finished my OET exam on this month, the 19th. I'm yeah. waiting for the research. As father said, I love OET, so I am still continuing learning with the EduSkills platform. And uh, actually, my um, Arya Mam uh, session helped me a lot to complete my reading part A within 13 minutes. Uh, I completed that day. I was feeling so happy. And again, I reviewed my uh, answers. So I am very thankful, Arya Mam. Thank you so much, Mam. Welcome, Rajendra. Deepa, Deepa, the material is available in the platform. Uh, if you go to the file session, uh, sections, it will be there, okay? Thank you. Thanks, Sydney. Super.